so I've been playing with Bedini's Earth Cells. Basically, his uh, cement battery types. Um, but I want to do something a little bit different. Instead of using... Instead of using uh, copper and magnesium, I instead use aluminum and aluminum. Basically what that means is both plates, which are aluminum wire, are both aluminum. And I still get a voltage. All this cell is, is a quick crete with distilled water, aluminum wire. Here's the version of aluminum wire I use. I got this off Amazon.com. As you can see, it's just aluminum wire they use for fencing. And there's how it's set up. I created this on the fourth month, third day, 2011. Uh, one plate right there is a spiral. Other plate is just a line. Basically, it's just aluminum wire. It's not hooked up to the meter right now. I'm going to hook it up to the meter, you guys can see. As the voltage jumps around, move it, connect it, move it, connect it, and you can see there's voltage. It's in the millivolt range. And there's volts. And that's coming out of there. Like I said, both wires are aluminum and I still get a voltage I'll, uh, also working on another thing it's the same principle um, both plates are aluminum this one's recharging a capacitor 22,000 microfarad it charged that capacitor right there to 500 millivolts I really perfected this cell that cell will produce about 700 millivolts. That one right there recharge that 220 microfarad at 50 volt capacitor uh, to 500 farads in about uh, 30 seconds or so. Like I said, same metals, aluminum, aluminum. Over here, same metals, aluminum, aluminum. Producing power. And show you guys the wires. So you guys believe me. And this black wire here has to my keyboard. So I don't know if y'all can see. That goes to the keyboard. And the black wire for the meters right there. So yep, even when you use aluminum and aluminum, you get power. Pretty cool. And when you use aluminum and aluminum, and not aluminum, copper, or aluminum, magnesium, you have eliminated the galvanic reaction. So it's within that within itself, this is pretty neat. All right, I want to record the amp draw from the cement water battery, same metals, aluminum wire. This is quick crete with distilled water. It's been sitting for uh, one day. It's already hardened. We'll see the amp draw. It's set to microamps. Hook it up and watch. Wow. Really wasn't expecting that number. So yeah, that's actually much higher than I expected. It's 55 microamps. Connect it up. And of course, this black wire is going to the keyboard. So we'll get that wire mixed up with this black wire. 
which goes to the meter. Same metals, aluminum, aluminum wire. There's the brand of aluminum wire I got off Amazon.com. Cement battery, uh, quick creep with distilled water, been sitting for a day. Aluminum wire, both are same plates, and that's the Amtral. I guess 54 microamps. Or so. It's much higher amps than I really expected. Both plates are the same metals.